Hey everyone, time for more Mass Effect 2. Where the fuck are we off to this time? In that wide open galaxy. Hmm, well. We got the Krogan. Hmm. Well, we could always go recruit the veteran, the professor, and archangel. Or the convict, even. Hell. Or we could go get a better submachine gun that doesn't suck. Because my personal favorite submachine gun doesn't come into play until, well, until about halfway through the game. So, might as well go get a, some, uh, a pretty damn decent submachine gun, all in all. And we get to wander about the Citadel for a while. Don't want to do too much on the Citadel, but I do want to go purchase some upgrades. Beep. Actually, no, I'll save the upgrades for when I actually have more money. And when I actually decide to do things on the Citadel. Besides from visiting Anderson. Get my Spectre status back. Bitch. <laughs> Switch to another weapon or use your powers. What powers? I turn invisible. <laughs> yeah. Tank. And since you're not Miranda, you can come along as well. Guess what? You actually didn't manage to level up off of that. That's... Mm. <laughs> oh well. Grunt, what kind of weapons do you... Hmm, let's see. Geth... Yeah, Geth Plasma Shotgun's pretty good, and the Matok, that's actually what I was going to give you anyway. So... Beep. Please tell me your password, Commander Shepard. Silence is golden. Good to finally meet you, Commander Shepard. Kasumi Goto. I'm a fan. Good to have you along, Kasumi. You ready to go? I travel light. I've already slipped my things aboard your ship. I'm really glad you're helping me out with the heist. Can't wait to see how you look in formal wear. I have a feeling you know something I don't. They didn't tell you? They call me secretive. I'm looking for my old partner's gray box. A man named Donovan Hawk took it, and I'm planning to get it back. Eh, okay. If that's what Cerberus promised you, we'll get it done. It'll be fun. And if we're lucky, you won't even have to draw your gun. Nah, we'll never get that lucky. We should probably wrap this up. You look pretty silly standing there talking to an advertisement. See you on the ship, Shepard. Yeah, like, it don't look fucking weird like this. I can do that too, you know. I just can't do shadow stuff. Okay, time to go grocery shopping. Figured they say something about our weapons. Shut it down. What? Do you seriously think? Yeah, okay. Sorry for the inconvenience, sir. Our scanners are picking up false readings. They seem to think you're... Uh, dead. I was listed as missing in action a couple of years ago. Would you mind checking in with my captain? He can reinstate you in our system. He's just past the scanners on your right. You'll have to make him scream a little. He's not gonna tell you everything just because you ask. I, I know, sir. If you don't have the stomach or you're worried about being reported, I can take care of it. No, sir. I can handle it. Yes? I see the problem already, Commander Shepard. My consul says you're dead. 
Your sergeant said you could help with that. Usually, you'd have to go through the station <laughs> security administration to reactivate your IDs, then to customs and immigration to regain access to the Citadel itself, and probably a stop by the Treasury. Spending a year dead is a popular tax dodge. <laughs> but I can see you're a busy man. So how about I just press this button right here, and we call it done? You're not big on formalities, are you? I'm with them right up until they keep people from doing their jobs. Good man. There. I just saved you about nine days of running around. That said, you should head up to the Presidium and tell them you're still alive. The Council probably wants to talk to the one who saved their scaly asses. I will. Having access to the Council and the Spectre's resources would be useful. Yeah. The Council can get anything. Best thing about working CSEC is that any equipment, information, or money you need, you get. Really? Anyway, something else you need? Or can I get back to work? I should be going. You need anything else? Let me know. Let's see here. Ooh. I hear this is the best place for food on Zakara Ward. Hmm. High grade provisions. Various quality cuisine items used to prepare diplomatic dinner and board starships. 500 credits. Fuck yeah. No more fucking spam on my ship. This is the best place for food on the whole day. Or even worse, treat. Ugh. It's like generic, cheaper spam. Oh, hey, bitch. Good day, my friends. Welcome to the Citadel. I'll give you an endorsement. These stores are owned by the council. The government employees get a discount. Yes, in fact. Uh, what's your position? I'm a former Spectre. My goodness. I didn't know Spectres quit. I don't believe you qualify for a discount, though. How about if I throw in an endorsement from the man who defeated Sarah? You or Shepard? My goodness. The increase in sales would certainly be worth offering a discount. What do you need me to do? Just voice your endorsement into my console. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. Excellent. I will get my clerical VI to add it to our advertising and Every motherfucking store is going to have that ad. Ah, space hamster. He's expensive, though. Maybe after I have all the upgrades. I need boom sticks more than I need... Boo. <laughs> Does this guy have anything? What can I do for you? Your expeditions might be a little tame for me. Tame? A human can hardly take down a feral Varen, let alone a Shatha. Who do you think you are? Well, my name's Shepard, and... The Shepard? The one that put down Saren Arterius? Oh, you do know me. By the spirits. <laughs> Shepard, in my store. I don't suppose I could convince you to record an advertisement for me. <laughs> sure you could. Can we work out a discount? A discount? I'd name my firstborn after you if you ask. Can we record it now? Just speak towards my console. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. <laughs> no other gun shop has that kind of endorsement. Until I walk down the street. Oh, what do we got? Offhand, eh, no. Uh, oh, subby gun. These are actually all weapons I use. This looks interesting. Oh, yeah. Eh. 50k with the fucking discount? Shit. Anyway. So what do you think? I have guns and shit. Yay! Boom, boom, bang, bang! Explodorama. Oh, hey, it's you again. You still don't have a proper name, do you, bitch? I interviewed you two years ago when you first became a Spectre. You punched me when my questions hit too close to home. Do you have a minute? What, so you can try to do another smear job on me? Your thuggish response and the facts did the job, Shepard. Not me. You're bad, you're news. 
I just want to give your story its due. Sources claim you were at the heart of the Presidium during the Battle of the Citadel. It's fair to say the course of the battle hinged on your words. Grunt. If true, you told I used to have a Krogan of my squad. I order him to skull fuck people. Hundreds of human lives and securing the continued dominance of the Citadel Council. The Turians lost 20 cruisers. Figure each had a crew around 300. The Ascension, the Asari Dreadnought we saved, had a crew of nearly 10,000. But surely the human cost. The Alliance lost eight cruisers. Chet Yang, Emden, Jakarta, Cairo, Seoul, Cape Town, Warsaw, Madrid. And yes, I remembered them all. Everyone in the Fifth Fleet is a hero. The Alliance owes them all medals. The Council owes them a lot more than that. And so do you. Commander Shepard, first human specter. Hero of the Battle of the Citadel. Checked in. We get it? Great. Bull rushed on my own show. <laughs> oh, open says me, motherfucker. Gotta get some booze for the doctor. Funny thing is, it doesn't cost anything. It's like, yeah, I need a bottle of brandy from a from a doctor, bitch. Hey, everybody! Guess what? I have a black hole generator on my back. Want to see what it does? <clears throat> that would be fucking perfect. <laughs> This <laughs> fire fucking black hole down down through the ward street. <sighs> Fuck punching the bitch. This meeting would be space more productive Rilla. if Udina was to join us. My advisor is unavailable. As counselor, I represent the voice of humanity and the alliance. Shepard will be here and Oh, Commander. We were just talking about you. It's been a long time, Anderson. I hope the last couple of years have treated you right. There have been some rough spots. It's good to have you back. We've heard many rumors surrounding your unexpected return. Some of them are... unsettling. We called this meeting so you could explain your actions, Shepard. We owe you that much. After all, you saved our lives in the battle against Saren and his Geth. The Collectors are abducting human colonists in the Terminus systems. Worse, we think they're working for the Reavers. The Terminus systems are beyond our jurisdiction. Your colonists knew this when they left Council Space. You're missing the important part, Counselor. The Reapers are involved. Ah, yes, Reapers. The immortal race of sentient starships allegedly waiting in dark space. Uh, we have dismissed that claim. Shepard, no one else encountered the hologram on Ilos that told you the truth about the Reapers. Only you and your crew ever spoke with Sovereign. I believe you. But without evidence from another source, the others think Saren was behind the Geth attacks. Hmm. Go back to Ilos and talk to Vigil. Or just look at what's left of Sovereign. It's obvious the technology is more advanced than ours. The hologram on Ilos is no longer functional, and we have found nothing to suggest that Sovereign was not a Geth creation. The Geth are capable of remarkable technological achievements. This is probably why Saren recruited them. This Reaper theory proves just how fragile your mental state is. You have been manipulated by Cerberus, and before them, by Saren. Saren was an organic. The Geth would never accept him as their leader. They only followed him because he was Sovereign's agent. Saren was a compelling and charismatic individual. He convinced the Geth the Reapers were real. Just as he convinced you. Yes, he persuaded a machine. The, the Reapers are just a myth. One you mm. insist on perpetuating. Yes. We believe that you believe it, but that doesn't make it true. Bullshit. I kept Saren from conquering the Citadel. I sacrificed human lives to save this council. We are in a difficult position, Shepard. You are working for Cerberus, an avowed enemy of the council. This is treason, a capital offense. That's too far. Shepard is a hero. I'm on this council too, and I won't let this whitewash continue. Maybe there is a compromise, not a public acknowledgement given your ties, but something to show peripheral support. 
Shepard, if you keep a low profile and restrict your operations to the Terminus systems, the Council is willing to offer you reinstatement as a Spectre. What does that mean? Will I need to start filing reports? That won't be necessary. This is a show of good faith on our part. We cannot become involved in an investigation regarding the missing colonies in the Terminus systems, but Spectre reinstatement shows our support of you personally. I accept your offer. It's good to have the Council on my side. Good luck with your investigation, Shepard. We hope for a quick resolution and a quick end to your relationship with Cerberus. What the? Well, Grunt, what the fuck are you doing? You Wait, what the hell? The Council's offer is just symbolic. They won't actually do anything. <laughs> what the hell's going on? Characters are just like running around places. Even if they don't help, I might as well stay on good terms. True enough. Don't worry about the Council or the Alliance. I'll find some way to keep them off your back. Shouldn't be too hard. As long as you keep to the Terminus systems. Anderson, we need to talk about... Shepard. What are you doing here? What the hell's wrong with your eye? Stop by to see how Anderson was doing. You don't have to cover for me. I invited Shepard here to speak with the Council. We just finished our meeting. You what? Consulate, do the words political shitstorm mean anything to you? The Council reinstated my Spectre status. They're just happy I'm staying out in the Terminus systems. Yes, I could see how that arrangement works best for both sides. But you really shouldn't have taken a step like this without consulting with me first, Consulate. I don't answer to you, either. Why don't you go to your office and think about that for a while? <laughs> of course. Consulate. Fucking Good day to both of you. Fucking grounded. Sorry ass. about that. Houdin has never gotten over the fact that I got the council position instead of him. Sometimes I need to put him in his place. Houdin is just doing his job. True enough. He's got his uses. And if you want something done on the Citadel, he knows who can make it happen. Plus, he's always happy to attend all those formal diplomatic functions I can't be bothered with. What happened to Gunnery Chief Williams after the Normandy was destroyed? Operations Chief Williams is still with the Alliance, but she's working on a special mission. It's classified. I can't say any more. Not while you're working with Cerberus, I'm sorry. How long did it take to get this place back up to speed after the battle? Still counting. The main areas of commerce and the most populated wards are complete. But estimates for total restoration are sitting around five years. The Keepers always surprise us, though. It's like our repairs are annoying. <laughs> we'll put up an ugly new bulkhead, and in a few days, they've made it seamless. We never really thought of them as heavy lifters, and I have no idea where they get the resources. But we'd never get done without them. I'm surprised no one can tell Sovereign isn't Geth technology. Didn't they examine the wreckage? We don't have much to look at. Pieces have been rained all over the station. It was chaos, with who knows how many species combing the wards for their dead. We secured as much of it as we could, but between the keepers and a whole lot of unauthorized salvage, there's no way to account for even half of that thing. Another reason why they don't want to acknowledge what Sovereign was. Last I knew, we were still fighting holdouts. They're here and there, but they are increasingly disorganized. It's long since stopped being called a war, more like cleanup. Not that you can ever discount them. But we haven't had serious casualties for months. A civilian ship will spot an enclave and we send in a squad to clear it. They're not quite the boogeymen they used to be. How have the last couple of years treated you? Serving on the council isn't how I plan to spend my twilight years. <laughs> Sometimes it feels like I'm just beating my head against a wall. Knowing the truth about Sovereign is brutal. It's nightmare stuff. I can't blame others for not wanting to believe it. But I know how important it is. So I keep trying. Fighting the good fight, right? Forget Udina and the Council. Join my crew and help me stop the Collectors. I'm too old to go racing. Make a mod! As much as I complain, I've got an important job to do here. The front line. That's got to be yours. Mm. I better go. Of course, Shepard. Lazy bastard. I wish I could do more to help you. But if you ever want to talk, 
I'll be here. Keep Just pulling. Do me a favor and be careful. You can't trust Cerberus. I know, look at this guy. Come on, tanky, let's go. Wait a second. No. <laughs> there was a shotgun on the floor, like Let's get back to the dock. Oh wait. Duh, I gotta go to the Normandy. <laughs> Alright, Joker, don't back this one up into anything. Wow, you actually managed to do it. Good for you. You don't fail at life this time. Hmm. Shit. <sighs> He thinks it's closing in on time to pass the fuck out for the evening. Hold spacebar to sprint. No, hold shift to sprint. Okay, what just electro farted at me? Hey, Jackass! Make me some sandwiches. Commander, those provisions you provided were perfect. I owe you. I've already thrown together some of my calamari gumbo. Here, try a bite. Truth told, it's based on an Asari recipe. Seems a little cannibalistic to me with their tentacle heads and all, but they ain't no good grub. <laughs> anyway, thanks again. You really came through. Cool, we're having like calamari stuff and shit. Time to get drunk. How may I help you, Commander? I have a present for you, Doc. Sarah's ice brandy? You didn't. <laughs> Thank you. I always regretted not opening that original bottle when I still could. I won't make the same mistake again. Why don't we open this bottle right here, right now, you and me? You crack open the bottle. I'll get the glass. <laughs> I thought Olenko's biotic display might have broken Jenkins' back, but Jenkins pops up and yells, That was awesome! <laughs> Oh, Jenkins. Soldiers like him make the Alliance great. Cerberus lacks the same enthusiasm. With your service record, you could have gotten a tour of duty on any Alliance ship. Why'd you really leave? Maybe it's less about leaving and more about staying. As a military doctor, I mostly treat people who are in bad shape. Often they die. And if I can help them, they move on. Either way, they leave. Don't you have any friends or family? <laughs> no, not lacking friendship. Just stability. Jeff, Joker will always have Vrolic syndrome. He would never admit it, but he needs my help, and he always will. I wish it weren't, but sadly, it's true. Treating Joker gives you a kind of stability. So does this ship, even if it's a copy. Or, hell, maybe it's you, Shepard. Hmm. Our removable center. A place for a person to stop and catch her breath. Or maybe I'm just happily drunk. Would it hurt if it was simple like that for once? Here's to simply being happily drunk. I'll drink to that. Woo! Waste uh, Wait. Metagel capacity? Fuck! <laughs> Get the doctor drunk and shit. You learn how to make metagel capacity and shit. Starboard observation deck is closed until me. Oh yeah, I forgot. This is where Katsume is. Hey bitch. P 
people are talking out there. And I hear it all. I usually travel hidden away in cargo bays. It's nice to be able to look out a window for a change. Mess Sergeant Gardner might just be an evil genius. Emphasis on the evil. The food's gotten better lately, though. I guess his reputation will take time to heal. <laughs> I'm not really sure what to do with myself. Not much call for thievery aboard a ship. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. Sure you will. Access to life support is restricted. Shut up. Uh, I could go talk to... No. 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 We are not going to go talk to Bucktooth. No messages for you, Commander. Yay, no... Mm-hmm. Well, actually, considering the length of a mission, I think I'm just going to cut this one off now. Call it a shorten, just like a, you know, run around and do random shit video. Uh, so I'll see you for the next mission. I'm going to go pass the fuck out and process all these videos. Later!